everyone. Okay, so this video and some videos following are going to be slightly different. They are conversations and I'm going to start them off and what I would like from you please is for you to, in the comment section below, um, leave your conversations about the topics that we're going to be talking about. So the first one today, because I think we don't talk very much. I think as a whole, and it's nice to have conversations, deep conversations, and to see where it leads us. So the first one that I'm gonna start off with today is about smacking, and smacking children in particular. Now, when I was younger, I'm 35, so when I was younger, smacking was a relatively common place. I'm not talking about beating a child, but smacking them when they did something wrong, or were naughty, or something like that. And I'm gonna give you an example because especially now it's very very much frowned upon and so I'd like to hear your take on things. When I was probably about eight or nine years old I lived by the sea and there was a section of the beach that had quite thick mud and it was sort of what you would call sinking mud. You would go down in it if you stepped in it and got too deep and me and my cousin um, were out playing as you do and we went into this mud and we sank, and we sank to such a degree that I was up in waist level and could not move and was going down slowly and the tide was coming in. The Coast Guards were called out and I was of course rescued. And when I got home, um, I remember being sat on the window ledge as the people that, you know, they dropped me off and I was sat there and they went. And my dad smacked me, he went straight for my thighs and really smacked me and I remember it really vividly and in that moment I hated him ever so much. My mum intervened. I never remember my mum smacking me but it probably happened but I don't remember it. But she intervened and that was over. It wasn't a beating, it was a smack. But I always remember thinking if I hadn't been smacked would I have gone and done it again? Because if I'd just been told off like don't do that again would it have had the same impact on me as being smacked? So, this is now open for conversation. Tell me what you think. Were you smacked as a child? Did it do you any harm? We're not talking beatings, just smack. So, were you smacked as a child? Did it do you any harm? Do you, are you an adult? And have you smacked your children? Let me know what your thoughts are on this topic and leave them in the conversation box below with the comments because I would love to read them and I will look forward to reading all your comments. Let me know what you think. Thanks so much, bye-bye.